Good morning everyone. I am Anantika Arya and I am going to explain you this activity electrical conductivity of some common liquids. From this activity we will need a 9 voltage cell, a LED that will light up with 9V cell and insulated copper wire like this of two colors. The black one is attached to the positive terminal and the red one is attached to the negative terminal and we have to arrange a setup like this now we need some plastic containers and we will fill up with lemon juice tap water milk soap solution vinegar salt water ghee and oil and one cotton cloth now we will see that which of these solution allow electrical conductivity to pass through them. I will try with the lemon juice. I will dip the wire in the lemon juice. Before that one thing we should keep in mind is that we do not touch the wire with each other because the circuit will be complete and the bulb will glow. The two wires should be little bit far from each other. Then I will dip it and you can see the bulb close. Then I will wipe it. Now here is tap water and I am trying with this. And it should be far from one another and you can see the bulb close. Then again I need to wipe it off. Now let us try it with milk. Now again we will take two free ends of the wire and the milk and you can see the bulb close. Then again I need to wipe it. Now we will try with the salt water. Okay. I am dipping the two free ends of the copper wire and again the bulb glows. Now, so we need to wipe it off. Now we will try with the vinegar. The bulb glows. Now we will try with the soap solution. The bulb glows with when I dipped in soap solution. We have to wipe every time. Now we will try it with oil. As you can see the bulb do not close with the oil now again I will wipe it with the two ends now we will see what happens with key now I will dip it in the key and you can see the bulb do not close when dipped in key. observe that the bulb close with lemon juice salt water soap solution milk vinegar and tap water because lemon juice salt water soap solution vinegar and tap water and milk contains ions ions are atoms or group of atom with a positive or a negative charge ions present in the solution make it possible for an electric current to pass through them and thus they are good conductors of electric current we will observe that with some liquids such as ghee and oil, the bulb do not glow because they do not contain ions in them and thus they are bad conductor of electric current. I hope with the help of this activity you have understood the concept of electrical conductivity of some liquids and about ions. Thank you.